a big round of applause. Thank you very much. Uh, I want to thank Adam for all the help that he's that he's helped me. He's this was the guy that I've worked with from day one since the gym was up. I want to thank him. Thank all the staff, Billy, Mark. Thank everybody. I want to thank everybody for coming. I want to thank you guys for all the support and. Uh, I, you know, I, I hope you guys end up loving this place as much as I do. Thank you guys very much. And without further ado, a special guest, Governor Neil Abercrombie. Thank you, BJ. Aloha, everybody. Aloha. I'm here today for a very special personal reason, of course. Uh, BJ and, and his mom, the entire gang over in, uh, in Hilo at the original location over there uh, have been good friends to myself, Senator Kahaley, and others uh, that are here today. But we've been good friends uh, not only on the basis of personal relationships, but we've been good friends on the basis of what BJ has brought to the Big Island, is now bringing to Oahu, and will be bringing to everyone who comes here under the aegis of the BJ Penn LFC gym. This is what's taking place. When you go to that facility, and you will see it at this facility as well, you're going to find young people. Young people who maybe have lost their way a little bit. Young people who have not even understood what way they need to go. Young people who are a bit confused. Young people who maybe don't think that there's much that life has to offer them. Or even worse, that they do not have very much to offer to the world around and outside themselves. Those young people are gathered together by BJ and uh, those who follow him, his staff, the management, those who are associated here with the IFC gym. All of these folks behind us have de dedicated themselves, yes, of course, to making their business operate and succeed. But in order for that to happen, they understand very well that the young people who come here to train not just themselves, but their minds and hearts as well, they understand that that takes an inspiration. They understand that that takes a dedication. And so I want to say to you that yes, we're dedicating this gym today, but more than that, it will represent as, the, as BJ's foundation does in Hilo right now and will do here. You will see young people coming and they will learn three things from BJ. It's carried him all the way through his career and carries him through as he opens this business opportunity and carries it forward for our people. First is discipline. Discipline. Young people who may never before have understood what that word means, never before have been able to see themselves and organize themselves and view themselves as worthy human beings. They do that because they're able to gain discipline here at this gym. Next, they get determination. If one can discipline oneself, then one can become determined. The reason they've fallen from the path or were never able to enter upon the path in the first place is they couldn't focus. They couldn't concentrate. They couldn't exercise determination. First discipline, then determination. And that leads to the final element of BJ's uh, foundation and for the philosophy of this gym, direction. They then understand where their life can go. They have confidence. They have esteem. They understand that they have brothers and sisters who are on this path with them. So whether it's a, a question of discipline, a question of determination, and finally direction, that's what they're getting from BJ Penn. That's what they're getting from this gym facility. That's what they're getting from the foundation. That's what they're getting from understanding that they are truly brothers and sisters with one another as they go through this pathway of life. So BJ, IFC, congratulations. The state of Hawaii is happy to have you here, and you can count on my full support. Aloha, mahalo. Imua, BJ Penn. Thank you so much, Governor.